Hey, how's it going everybody? Sarasota Tim. Coming to you from Walmart. <laughs> I just got off work at Publix. All right, where's my keys? I got my keys. And I didn't grab anything in there because they're too expensive. But I'm hungry and it's nice out. I think I'll fire up the grill. Throw a hamburger or a steak or some chicken or something on and uh, today was a very cool day I did the um, watermelon <laughs> and Boca Raton Federal Highway first time I did that Publix very nice people in there customers employees manager really uh, I've been around I've gotten a different flavor some of them are just don't even want to smile and you know everybody has a bad day but everybody was sitting on all eight cylinders over there today i like that story it's a very old Publix, very small it's so small in the parking lot they don't even have a buggy return area so they got a guy fetching them all the time and uh, it doesn't have near the square footage that some of the new ones they're building but i learned today there's 874 probably a few more that are being built right now somewhere but 874 and counting Publixes uh, in business, and that's including all the states they're in. And I guess their goal is to be nationwide one day. So uh, I'm going to Walmart here, and I got some, uh, I was checking on my comments today. The comments are going like crazy. The subscribers, it's like filling up my gas. It's like you can see the meter running. Every time I look at my phone, I got more subscribers. So this is really good, really good. Let me get back to you guys in a few minutes after I go into uh, Walmart here. But uh, you guys know if Walmart doesn't have it, I don't need it. And I have a salad, so I think I'm going to get some chicken maybe to put on it or some salmon, some fish. Yesterday I tried to eat fish at a restaurant and somehow I had to, some reason I had to send it back because my plate and the fish tasted like Clorox. So the manager came out. She said they've been putting Clorox down the drain in the kitchen. And so she says that, you know, I totally understand. So they brought me something else. But I wanted fish because I had sea bass. My buddy bought it for me yesterday. He treated me to lunch because I treated him last. And these look good put these on the grill <laughs> what the hell <laughs> all right i always look i always look for these yellow tags right here because you can save all right let me get back to you in a minute all right i'm really thirsty let me see which one i'm gonna get here i'm not really sure <laughs> psych this is what i'm drinking i heard that this is the best water and this these two aquafina and Dasani, they're made by reverse osmosis. The other ones have sodium, salts, and all these other things that uh, may not be the best. And if it's just basically like, same as your spigot, why buy that? And Dasani's a little pricey, but I'm gonna go for it. <laughs> it was funny. This guy, uh, I do this self-checkout. So there's a guy, he's trying to do self-checkout, and. You know, half the machines never work or they're off. No big deal. There's plenty of them. But he's got that discouraged look on his face. But he come here. He's here. And when you pay at the self-pay at Walmart, you know, I use Walmart to pay with my phone. I have the app. Because, you know, I'm a Walmart guy. And he said something that I knew what he was talking about because I'm a Walmart guy. He said... I'd give them no stars, but then they wouldn't know I was here <laughs> because he tried to use the machine and he didn't even look for the green light. You know, they have a little green light up on the top that shows if the machine is available. And he tried to go to one that wasn't available. And when you get through paying on the self-pay, you can give the uh, a rating of one to five stars. So when he said that, I thought I didn't say anything to him. It's like, hey, why are you here, though? 
you know, don't bitch. Go to go to Publix. Go to Winn Dixie. Go to Trader Joe. You get all the money. Anyway, hot as Hades out here. I think the heat index is 102. And you know, I can only walk from the store to this forerunner. Woo! And get in there without air conditioning. Uh, man, my chest is so sore from the gym. Here you go. This is for Shane. <laughs> I'll get back to you guys. Yeah, I returned my card over there like a good boy. But I was walking back to the forerunner. I wanted to show you. Boy, those KO2s really fill out the wheel well and make a forerunner look so much different, so much more off roadish than the stock uh, Dunlops that came with mine. They might use a different type of uh, attire and other models. Maybe a Michelin is on the limited or something, but look at those babies. 38,000 miles. They're looking good. 46 PSI is what I run. Stock size, they're not oversized or anything. Anyway, today was a great day because I crushed it.